We're having another great auction Thursday night, 11 11 of 2010 at 6 30 at the Barry Auction, 1797 West Street in Barry, Mass., which is Route 122. Straight shot from the Worcester Airport uh, on 122 all the way here. Or we're uh, just outside of Gardner, right outside of Athol um, and Orange, and uh, pretty easy to get to. So I'm going to go through the auction with you here. Uh, everything's not even here, but I'm not even organized yet, but wanted to get a video up. Here's a uh, repro, repro um, Victrola that's going to go up for auction tomorrow night. There's a couple of early banks here, and I'm going to have to go through this quick. So a couple of early banks. There's some uh, stereo optic, uh, stereo view cards. There's a whole bunch of them in there. There's some fishing lures. There's a bunch of old records like that. There's a sap bucket back there. There's a, uh, a vintage uh, toolbox there. It's made out of wood. Uh, and there is a, a lot of these I won't be looking at. It's just marked USA. It's a nice bowl there. There's some old photos there. Uh, that looks like a Majelica uh, planter. Uh, let's see. There's a phone there. Look at that phone. Nice. There's an old Esso uh, advertising sign there. Uh, it's a picture of a gas station. I'll go this way. There's some early, uh, a book of early postcards here. A whole bunch of them in there. There's some other early tin types and photos there. There's some uh, pocket knife, a pocket knife collection. There's a military lot collection. There's a nice vase there. There's another uh, a figurine. There's some heavy cast iron bookends. There's some old books, Honey Bunch. And uh, that one is Uncle Tom's Cabin. Here's some uh, 45s, Beatles, Beatles, Elvis, uh, and a whole bunch of other ones. There's another knife uh, over there. That looks like a Majelica piece there, and also right there. This is uh, this is a Hall piece there. Uh, there's a uh, 50s uh, desk thing there with um, it's got a barometer, a thermometer, and different things on there. There's a black Americana lighter. This is a uh, oh. Roseville. This I was told this is a very rare pattern, and it is broken on the um, the handles broken right here. If this was not broken, it'd be worth about a thousand dollars. But uh, it, of course, you know it'll do what it'll, whatever it'll do tomorrow night. Here's some uh, more fishing lures. I got a bunch of uh, lots of fishing lures. This is a rare. It's a Laurel and Hardy uh, comic book, but it's uh, the first edition. Uh, in the first issue of that one. Uh, there's some military photos in here. There's some also uh, military patches in there and other patches. There's some more early photos here. World War II that's dated 1944 and this book is full of them. Here's a uh, a lot of uh, forest fire, uh, prevent forest fires and there's other different posters in here for the forest fires. There's another book here. These are all train related photos in there. Uh, and that's full. Oh, let's see. There's a 70s clock, Starburst clock. There's a, uh, there's a vintage sign there. When good friends get together. There's a uh, Donald Duck piece there. There's a vintage little monkey playing the drums. Uh, and these are all these are McCoy and Hall and whatnot. Uh, I'll just go through them. There's a cookie jar there. There's a nice uh, candy dish there. Look at that planter. That's beautiful. That is a uh, that's a Hummel beehive uh, statue there. Uh, there's some other figurines back there. There's a uh, vintage uh, sprinkler. Uh, this is I think this is Majelica too. Uh, no, that's Hummel. That's a Hummel right there. Uh, there's a an old flashlight there. Look at this. This is a nice bowl there. Yellow. 60s clock. Uh, figurine. There's ice tongs. There's kitchen stuff. There's a uh, coffee grinder. There's an uh, advertisement cake and flour pan. Uh, Aunt Jemima cookie jar. 
There's a uh, Mickey Mouse clock. There's another grinder there. Another uh, coffee grinder. Figurines there. This is full of um, Hummel-like uh, figurines. There's some old books there. There's some old advertising there. There's a uh, blowtorch. We've got a wide variety of interests here uh, in this auction. Here's some more early postcards again, and this book is full of them again. There's an Indian bank. There's a uh, set of field glasses. That's a Belik uh, vase there. And that's another nice piece right here. I forget what it is. Uh, I don't, let's see. Mm, I can't quite read it, but I will at the auction. I don't have my gla good glasses. There's a pond boat there. There's a Majelica piece there, and there's a Majelica fish. Uh, there's some early banks. This is 1933 World's Fair, uh, and it's dated on the front. 1933 World's Fair bank. There's another early bank there. There's another early bank there. There's another early bank there. If you're into banks, there's another one there. There's a laundry sign. There's some nice early bowls, mixing bowls, batter bowls. Uh, did I mention the sap bucket over there? Uh, there's another batter bowl. Here's some uh, old uh, cigarette advertisements with vintage license plates. There's one with an antique in here. Antique plate. There's a bunch of other ones too. 39. Uh, they're all older ones. There's a ton of them in here. There's a 21 card upside down because I turned the camera upside down. Anyway, there's uh, I think that's Ted Williams. There's a uh, monkey symbol guy there. Uh, there's another ball. There's a uh, Evil Knievel game. Uh, and that's all in there. There's some really nice uh, coffee pots there. There's a Majelica base there. There's another coffee pot. Uh, there's a, a figurine there. I don't know if I'll have time to go through everything. I mean, I've got a ton of stuff. There's another, another uh, figure there. There's a painting. It's upside down, but it's assigned oil on the canvas. There's some wallpaper. There's some movies. There's another uh, figure there. There's a stoneware bowl and uh, pitcher and bowl. There's a nice clock. That clock works too. I was it was ticking before. Uh, I just didn't wind it today. There's a copper pot there. There's a uh, there's a lot of uh, stuff that will all go together. 40's uh, Shilton's manuals. There's some other stuff there. There's some uh, Life magazines from the World War II. Nice bowls and pictures over there. There's uh, more fishing lures and there's an old underwear ad right there. This is a Royal Dalton uh, mug there. Look at this squeeze box. I really like that. Uh, nice squeeze box. There's uh there's a wooden thing there. There's a mantle clock. And this is a uh, Wyandotte fire engine. Really nice there. World War II helmet with rounds on the top of it. There's a, a cast iron uh, butler there. There's more stuff there. There's uh, a couple of things there. Uh, plates. Uh, there's a, a lamp. There's a Kennedy bank. There's fishing reels. There's more fishing lures and reels over there. There's a nice rider truck. That's a uh, You can ride on that if you're a kid. And it's an old one. Scale. Uh, this there. That, that there. Uh, I have... It's not up right now. I have uh, gold, silver, jewelry. Here's some old badges and stuff. This is uh, Spencer Fire Department right here. There's another one... Uh, Indian Service Police, Rosebud Reservation. There's another one, Fire Department here. Uh, tons of stuff in this auction. Here's an old carnival sign. Gun ball. Uh, there's a fire engine, and there's more. There's more coming up uh, that I don't have here yet. There's some old snowshoes, dining room table. Uh, dining room table there. There's some uh, ice cream chairs there. There's a record cabinet, there's a vintage, uh, there's a country piece there, tons of stuff. 
Barry auction tomorrow night, uh, Thursday night, 6.30, 11.11 of 2010, 6.30, and it's at 1797 West Street, Barry, Mass. You can come a little early and preview. The auction starts at 6.30. Hope to see you here.